Hey everyone, we're here in the Formula 2 paddock uh, and they just launched the Formula 2 2024 car. Uh, so yeah, let's go uh, have a look and see what it looks like. I think it looks pretty fast. Uh, yeah, it's yeah. looking uh, really good. So I'm going to show you some of the details of the car and uh, see what's coming for next season for these guys in uh, Formula 2. Should be cool. Yeah. So guys, here's the new Formula 2 car that will be making its debut on track in 2024. The Lara is still the manufacturer of the chassis. A lot of the parts on the car, there's a lot of similarities between the F2 car and the Super Formula car in Japan because the Lara manufacture the Super Formula cars and they're a very, very fast car. And the objective of this new F2 car was to make it more similar to an F1 car in terms of driving style and as well appearance. So they wanted to add more downforce to this new Formula 2 car. They're doing that with the wings as well with the diffuser and as well to make it look a bit closer to a Formula 1 car. Looking at the front wing, it looks quite aggressive. As I said, quite similar to a Super Formula car. The side pod and the side of the car looks the same as this current Formula 2 car. Obviously, they will continue using the halo, which is super important for the safety of the drivers. It's saved so many drivers uh, since it's been uh, you know, instated into these uh, open wheel cars. Now looking to the inside of the cockpit, it looks like they're going to use the F3 steering wheel, um, which personally I don't like too much. It looks a little bit too complicated, too many buttons in my opinion. Um, but let's see if uh, if they decide to move forward with that. And moving on to the back of the car, very different looking rear wing. Um, I think, you know, to generate more downforce, the DRS will still be in full effect. So this wing has a DRS system in place and the diffuser and the floor of the car. Uh, it's something that they're going to use to generate a lot more downforce um, and make the cars go quicker in the corners. That's the objective um, of this new Formula 2 car. They will keep the same engine, so the same Mega Chrome engine with about 620 horsepower. The car should be slightly heavier, but like I said, it will generate more downforce. And they'll be using the same tires, 18-inch Pirelli tires. So yeah, this is the new Formula 2 car. The team should be receiving their first cars in January, where well, they'll be able to do a shakedown with one car. And then all the cars will be allowed to test at the first preseason test, which I believe is in February.